Hi, I'm Dave Casera here at my gallery in Stanwood, Washington, and I'm with artist Eve McCauley uh, from LaConnor, Washington. Eve's here for a meet and greet and an exhibition that will be um, on view through April 1st. So we're going to talk about a few of these paintings. Um, the first one is Finding Higher Ground. Uh, Eve's going to talk about this series of three paintings that we have here, and uh, we can find out a little bit more about what influenced her, her work here. So, hi Eve. Hi. Um, yeah, Finding Higher Grounds is a series. I have two other pieces that go with it. And it was done for a Mona Surge uh, show or festival in um, LaConnor, Washington in 2016. And a group of artists and scientists came together and collaborated to understand um, the climate change and awareness from their data. And then artists were asked to distribute a, uh, and translate that data into um, art. And so I chose to do a kind of daunting view of what they said would be when the ice caps are melting, there's gonna be water rising, be flooding, a lot of storm surges. That's why the, the um, show is called Surge. And um, so these are very moody, very dark. There's very little bit of light. And this piece is called Finding Higher Grounds because as you stand here, you would just be able to experience the ocean but not um, probably be part of the ocean. So it's just survival instincts. <laughs> You really captured the mood of these with the stormy, mm -hmm. gray, end of the world, Armageddon. Yeah. <laughs> and it but it also has a peacefulness to it as well. Yeah. Right, let's move on to the next one. Tell us about this one. So this is uh, more of the flooding, but this was actually of a road here in Skagit Valley. Um, so there's still, you know, electricity happening, but the, the roads are being taken over and we've been seeing this happen here recently um, and over the years more and more flooding is happening. So this seems to be, um, the, the truth is coming forward about climate change. And it's just really dramatic. The point is to really elaborate Mother Earth as being the dominant source and force and as we you know have to adapt to um, the change of this world. So really just trying to emphasize the uh, grandiose. <laughs> I love the perspective of this yeah. one really drawing you down about that road that we're on. Yeah. In terms of how our, how our uh, weather is changing and things like that. And this is the third piece here. Yeah. So I like the title of this one. Yeah. These are the tides that try men's soul and our souls. And um, this is one of my favorites. I, I got inspiration from La Push um, near Forks. Um, That's on the Olympic Peninsula. Yeah. And there's a lot of land masses that have already been eroded by nature for millions of years. I'm sure this is a very old story of, of our world, but us as individuals um, might not have seen what it took to carve these stones. And so, this is really, again, let's showcase how powerful um, and how real these surges are and that it's hard to um, be amongst this kind of power. But um, yeah, hopefully it invokes <laughs> that grandiose. Thanks, Eve. And you guys can come down between, well, we'll be here till five o'clock. You can meet the artist and talk about her work and some of the other works. And we hope to see you here soon. Peace. <laughs>